The day my mother actually left, a reporter asked me what I thought of my mother going into space. I didn't want to answer, so I hid my face behind my grandmother's purse. My brother laughed at me, so I hit him on the arm. My grandmother gave us lifesavers to quiet us down. I put mine in my pocket for later. Then my mother joined us. She let me hold her hand while she talked to reporters. I played with her wedding ring, and I was really proud that I was one of the few people who got to touch her hand. She was showing the reporters some of the things she was going to take up into space. I was jealous, and I wanted to give her something else, so I pulled out the lifesaver. It was fuzzy from the lining of my pocket. While my mother and the reporters talked, I tried to make the lifesaver look presentable. I told myself that I had to pick off all the lint or my mother wouldn't come back. Finally, my mother crouched down next to me. She was wearing her blue spacesuit and she looked so beautiful. And my grandmother kept saying, say goodbye, honey, say goodbye to your mother. But all I could manage to do was hold out the lifesaver. My mother took it and put it in her pocket and I thought everything would be all right. These are the reasons I gave myself for why my mother didn't come back. One, I hit my brother. Two, I wouldn't talk to the porters. And three, I didn't get off all the lint from the lifesaver.